I'm Alex with Storyline Travel. At Storyline Travel, we're family travel specialists helping families create memorable experiences through travel. In this video, we're on the Norwegian Preben, checking out activities that come with your cruise fare. So what's included on your Norwegian Prima cruise with activities? First, there's the Pulse Fitness Center. The Fitness Center has quite a bit of cardio equipment. They have bikes and treadmills. They also have rowing machines and even an area space for you to do yoga or calisthenics. It's a great place to work off all that extra food you've been eating and there is a scale if you dare to get on it to see just how much you've gained. Additionally, the gym has free weights for you to get in that workout. While the gym is on the forward part of the ship, the stadium can be found on the aft part. There are table games like shuffleboard in this area, as well as foosball tables. There's a beer pong game set up. Well, pong minus the beer, but you still try to get it in the cups. And they even have a pickleball court. In addition, they have ping pong tables that are kind of blocked from the wind and we took a shot at playing a little ping pong. Um, maybe the skills weren't as good as I imagined them. There's even a ping pong table that's round. Well, at least it keeps the ball from going side to side. And in this area, you'll find Rush, the dry slide that goes down several decks, starting from the stadium and ending on deck eight. It is quite a bit of fun. And that's the drop, the slide on the other side of the ship that gives you an immediate rush as the floor underneath you pulls out. And again, you go down to deck eight, but on the other side of the ship. The Prima is a family ship. And if you have uh, little ones with you, the um, splash pad is a great place to go with lots of fun water fountains, it's a great place for the kiddos to run around, get wet, and really enjoy the ship. Near the splash pad is the wave water slide. It's a great place for adults and teens to get a thrill as they ride this giant water slide. Once you get done on the water slide, there's a main pool nearby. It is smaller than on most cruise ships, but there are more pools around the ship, like these infinity pools that allow you to watch the ocean while you swim. The Prima provides a number of places to just relax, enjoy the cruise, and get some sun. Whether it's these day beds or loungers, there's little pocket places all over where you can relax. For example, the sculpture garden. You see, the Prima is designed to give you multiple places to go and enjoy the ocean views, the deck spaces all around the ship. And the sculpture garden is a good example where it's quiet, there's some interesting art to observe, and you can just enjoy the peacefulness of cruising along the ocean. If you'd rather spend time relaxing indoors, the Observation Lounge is an excellent place to go on the Prima. This area is forward of the ship and high up with beautiful windows, floor to ceiling, giving you a great view of the ocean in a quiet area where you can sit and relax. This area is similar to a library on many ships as there are books to read and games to play. You'll notice that there are both couches and, and chairs for relaxing. There are tables for maybe a light snack or a drink at the bar as the observation deck does have a bar area for your enjoyment. Included activities in the evening would be the Improv Club. While you do need reservations to get in, they are included in your cruise fare, and it's a great place to have a laugh as you watch the comedians on board. 
The main area on the Prima for shows is the Prima Theater and the Prima Nightclub. It's a really interesting and new way to see a show on a cruise ship. This theater is fully transformational. As you can see, the chandelier moving up and down with its different lights, but also all the seats can retract and turn it into a nightclub when the shows are done. Please be aware that some of these shows may require a reservation. While included in your cruise fare, you will be locked out from seeing it if there's no space available and you didn't get a reservation made. As an example of how this theater converts, when we watch the production, The Noise Boys, you can see that the stage was much bigger and the chairs had completely changed from when we saw the more theatrical production of Donna Summers. Which activity are you most excited to try out on the Norwegian Prima? Leave us a comment below and let us know. And while you're here, give us a like on this video. And finally, at Storyline Travel, we believe every adventure is a story waiting to be told.